Viewer discretion is advised. is filmed on location with the men and women of law enforcement. All suspects are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. My coworkers and I all have different qualities. Uh, some people are excellent with tactical things. I'm a little bit more of a social worker kind of cop. Um, I like a lot of that digging to get problems solved, but uh, we all work together with our different qualities, uh, come together as one, and solve problems as best as we can. So there's a white sedan that we suspected was uh, in a domestic violence call yesterday. The suspect's known to have a gun, so we're going to see if we can catch up to him and see if it's him. Yeah, we're at Lombard in St. Louis. We're behind the 2002 Mercedes. Uh, there's PC for the driver yesterday. Fill the signal for now. Or uh, a lewd and criminal mischief, too. It's going to be Austin. And you got him pulled over? He's take, yeah, he's taking off on us, westbound, Lombard approaching Catlin. He's gonna carry a firearm. Yeah, he's known to carry a gun from St. Louis. Turning on our way from St. Louis. Do you want to go? 3616, I'll be number two. He's heading to the St. John's Wood. He's bailing, he's bailing. Get someone in Pure Park. Get someone in Pure Park. Go, 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 go. Get somebody in Pure Park, he's bailing. Grab his waist. He's on foot. Just... Stop! Stop! Don't Stop! Move. You're gonna... Don't move! Put your hands Don't move! Your back. Don't move! Put your hands behind your back. On your head. There you go. Challenging one at gunpoint. Don't you do anything Got stupid. Him, you understand me? Put the gun down. Don't do anything stupid. Put the stupid. gun down. Put the gun That's down. That's not happening, Give Austin. Give him commands. Give him commands. All right, Austin. Austin. What do you want Austin, me to do? Lean okay. over. Stare it there. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? I want you to slowly lean over and put I'm, on your stomach. Slowly I'm keep your hands up. I'm going to do anything you guys want me to do. You're considered armed and dangerous. I'm not keep armed. Keep your hands up. Get on your you, stomach. You, get back. Get, get on back. your stomach I'm not now. armed. What do you get want me to do? What do you want me to do? On your stomach now. I have my hands on my, my hand. My hand. Yes, just roll over onto your stomach. Do it now. But just, you don't got to do nothing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to apply. Put your arms out. Put your arms out. Put your arms out. Out to your sides. You got them, sir. I'll get this side. Sides. Put them on your back. Go ahead and cut them up. What did I do wrong? It's probably cause of arrest you for eluding criminal issues too from yesterday. What? Okay, let me get this side. We'll explain to you in a minute. Hey! Hey! Tell Jerome. Austin, do you have any weapons on you? No. Is there anything on you that you shouldn't have? We're 61, everybody uh, slow down. You guys can search. I'm yeah. asking if you have any weapons yeah, on you. Yes, sir. I don't have nothing. Right at the entrance. Hey! Door. Call my female and tell her to bail me out. Okay, bail me out. Switch feet. Switch feet, Austin. Switch feet apart. Go on, 61. Is there anything on your nose? You have a tail pointing in my face. We ain't cool. Someone has a white Mercedes. You had a tail pointing in my face. Didn't mean to. You didn't mean to? No, I'm being charged with. You're being charged with yesterday for a lewd. Criminal mischief too for what happened with your girlfriend. A lewd again for this. I ain't got nothing on me, pussy. I, f off I me. got a check. Get on my left side. What are you doing? I'm sorry. A switch. I told you I could search my car, you pussy. Search my <laughs> man. So what happened between you and girlfriend yesterday? This is what it started everything. Uh, nothing happened. Well, what was the whole deal about like kick jumping on her car and stuff? I don't know. What? I don't. I don't know. That's why I'm asking you. That's just what I was told. I came over there and banged on the door and asked her to come out. Do you know you broke the door? I banged on it with my hand. They said I was knocking it. loud because they couldn't hear me. I didn't break it. I don't think I broke it. You, you did, dude. Was it what a little dent? No, you broke the wood frame, man. You're banging on a car. You guys didn't find a weapon yet. I don't need the weapons. I got these two hands. I'm like, you guys, that wasn't your job to point that shit in my face. I'm doing my job. You see me out here in these streets? I see you. I'm doing my job. I see you right. as much as you see me. Believe that. Let's walk over there. Come on. 
Have a seat, Austin. It's hot in here. So Josh, we're on our window, please. Yeah, we're going to transfer to a different car here in just a minute, so. Oh, y'all can just leave it up? I can just hang tight. Okay, hold on. Yeah. I got to drive it, so you can't drive it with it open. OK, I'll meet you over there. Yesterday, he broke down his girlfriend's door, caused some damage. Last night, officers got to a short pursuit with him. He was considered armed and dangerous, per his grandmother, saying he had uh, weapons on him. Just a little bit of marijuana. We'll have to put that in property. This is Courtney's car? Yeah, I'm over there. Yeah. Can I release it to Courtney's mom? No, you can't. You released it to my hand. That, that, those keys don't go to Courtney. Why, why are you doing car. that, Austin? That's in my bill of sale. It's, she paid for it. She paid for it. The bill of sale is in my, name. The in my name in the vehicle. OK, that's fine, it's Austin. You know what? Okay. I paid it's for materialistic. It. That's fine. I paid for it. Let's go. I'll release it to the Yeah, that's room. fine. And, okay. and we'll see you in court, too. You see right. who, bitch? You. I'll call child support on you, you tweaker. Oh, they don't get my keys. Okay, yeah, I'm not. Yeah. They don't touch those Grandma's keys. Grandma's coming. Grandma's coming. We got this all taken care of. They don't I have get your those car. keys. I have your car. There's you engine oil leaking. So okay. if you drive it, it'll overheat. No, honey, I'm going to go park it. And if you want me to, I will take it to the shop. Can you put it, no, can you just put it in your parking space, please? Yes, I will, baby. And I'm sorry. There's engine oil coming out. I love out. you, Austin. I love you too. It's cool. Okay, and I'm here for you, baby, okay? It's cool. I pray for you, baby. You know I'm here, okay? I'm so sorry. You're not making good decisions. Hold on, though. Let's let's put that aside. You're not making good decisions, man. Look, we run into each other, we respect each other, and I can. Hold on. But what I want to do is help you out. Equal to me. What I want. Point a taser in my face when I'm on the ground. Can you? Can you talk to me? Look at me. On the ground, handcuffed. You're pointing a taser in my face. That doesn't make sense, bro. Austin, look at me, man. What if you were on the ground? I had a Glock in your face. I'm I'm trying to help you out here. Stop driving like that, man. Make make better decisions, all right? Thank you. We'll get you on your way. I'm constantly asked about the scar on the back of my hand. We were executing a lawful search warrant down on the lower side of the county for narcotics, and I was the man with the uh, battering ram. And upon swinging, you know, there was a glass inlay that shattered, and it pretty much cut straight through the back of my hand. But to me, it's a large reminder of the dangers of this job and uh, you know how things can go wrong in a split second. <laughs> Deputy Pennington observed the Escalade that we know, well-known drug dealer. Uh, from the other side of the county. Uh, he's weaving in and out of traffic. I think he spotted my vehicle back at the off-ramp. Uh, he was only supposed to go right, but he turned left. He's weaving in now. He knows I'm coming for him. I think he turned. I think he made the right right here. There it is. Right here. He just wrecked. Where'd he go? Hey, go ahead. Go ahead. Get in the car. Get in the car. Get in the car. Nobody in the car. Where'd you go? Watch out, watch out, watch out. Where, where you at? Cop, you 69? Yeah. All right, we'll head back to the truck. Pennington got him off Elm Tree, 67 one. I'm gonna go back, make sure this lady up here is okay. Drop this hat too. Hey, are you all right? Fine. Are you hurt? No, it just scared me to death. How bad? I don't know if it's drivable. I mean, you never can. Probably be pushed out. Okay. When he hit you, what did he say anything, or he just hopped out he and just looked ran? And ran. I couldn't tell you what he looked like. That's all right. We got him. Okay. What, what what happened? I came over here. I figured he was gonna go to this next street over. And as I'm looking down the road, he runs right past my car. I get out and chase him. Started chasing him for a little bit. And he just kind of just stopped. He finally, finally stopped and gave up. Yeah. Did he already? He, he pretty much recognized what was happening. Yeah, he recognized it back there at 77 Lee's. Road. Yeah, when he decided he was gonna weave in and out of traffic, uh, do stupid stuff to try to get away from us. I don't know what this dude's problem is. This is the driver of the car here. Some of we're very familiar with. Some of us drive this car were. We know him all too well. Decided he wanted to run from us. This your unlucky day. You want to talk to me? What's up? What happened? What's up, man? Y'all, man, y'all keep with me, man. Why y'all keep 
fucking with me, man. I don't want to pull you off the line. All right, well, well, if, if, if I remember correctly, I didn't put any blue lights on you. You just decided you were just going to take off. No, you put blue lights on, man. You put blue lights well, I put. I put blue lights on so I can try to catch up to you. Who? Who you talking about? You! Why'd you run? Who? Run. Why'd you run? Man, I ain't run. You didn't run? No. No, man. Y'all just keep messing with me, man. But if, if I remember, if I if I noticed correctly, this is your hat. Oh, th this belongs to you. This hat belongs to you. This hat was. This hat was in the middle, back over there, just the direction where you ran. And then you ran across my partner's car back over here. So you want to talk to me about it? No, how's your extra partner? He just beat me the f up for nothing. No, my partner didn't do hey. anything to you. My partner detained you because you were running from us. Man, what did you talk about, man? You talking about, man, I ain't running. Why'd like... you run? Did you feel like you did something wrong? Yeah, man, you got no f***ing license, man. No trying to come to jail. I just went to jail for nothing, man. I don't sound no f***ing dope, man. All I do is smoke weed. You, you, just, you just went to jail for having marijuana on I your person. That's what I said. All I do is smoke weed. Y'all took my f***ing money for nothing, man. Why am I on God, no, man? I don't the only thing I do is, man, where is driving on the suspension, man. That's the only thing I do, It's wrong. illegal. Don't, you can't do it. You can't drive. I you can't man. have drugs. Don't do it. If you're going to drive on the suspension, you got to be a man about yours and take your punishment, man. If you're going to get that ticket, get that ticket. Don't run from us. Uh, you wrecked. You hit this person. You could have hurt her seriously. You run. You got us chasing after you. Guns out. Uh, I mean, come on, man. For what? Man, I panicked. You panicked? I panicked, man. I, man, I put this on my life, man. I Panic, man. I'm Listen, man, what does help me, man? I'm some real shit, man. Help me, Mr. Raven, man. I Let swear, me back. man. Just sit tight, man. Sit tight. Just relax. Relax. Slow you. Just slow down, all right? Well, this gentleman here, we know him well. Arrested him about two weeks ago, and apparently he just feels like we're harassing him. But, you know, the truth of the matter is we know uh, uh, he's a well-known drug dealer uh, in that area where he was and on the lower side down here. EMS check you out and everything's good? Huh? Yeah, I signed off. OK. I'm good. So you don't need to get transported or anything like that now? No. What exactly happened? Where were you when, when, it, when it happened? I was second back from the, the red light. It had just turned green. Mm -hmm. And Ernest was in front of me. He's a co-worker. OK. Um, he had turned. And I seen traffic coming. I heard some screeching. And I stopped. OK. I just, I just moved up just a tiny bit. And I stopped right where I was. Mm -hmm. And I seen him, he tried to make that turn, and I knew he wasn't going to make it. OK. And he ran right into it. Ran right into it. When he, when he got out of the vehicle and ran, did he say anything to you? No, he just looked at me and took off. And he just took off. Uh, highways and route, they're coming here because they have to work the accident. Uh, right. So of course, his insurance, because as you can see, he's living life large. Uh, so his insurance will be able to take care of that. Uh. OK. Listen, all right, you don't have anything you want to say? Oh, man, I don't have nothing that really I want to say, bro. Did you want to say something to the woman that you hit? I don't want to say nothing to nobody. You I ain't hit nobody. Okay. All right, Des. You know you don't got no license. So you know you're in charge of driving under suspension, whatever it might be. You also get in charge of failure to stop for blue light and siren. Huh? Just wanted to let you know. All right? Well, I grew up in Pocatello, Idaho. My father was a law enforcement officer over there. He was my role model. So everything that my dad was doing and how he did it, I took to heart and ultimately followed a lot of his example. Hey, Victor, four, one, no further, so I'm behind a vehicle right now that it's got a four, four, six, no license three, plate, three, but it's got what would look like a temporary registration. Yeah, it looks like it's been handmade. So I'm going to initiate a stop up here and contact the driver and talk to him three, about this three. plate. What's the deal with the license plate here? You don't have one on your car. I just got the car yesterday. It's the bill of sale. So you have not registered it, obviously? Uh, they, no, I have not. They were not open. OK, uh, do you have a driver's open. license? OK. Is it in your wallet, or is it somewhere else? Right Are you on probation or parole no, right I'm now? I'm not. OK, I see your inmate card there. Is that uh, you're topped out? You're topped out? Yeah. What would you do time for? Uh, forgery. Forgery. Yeah. So do you have insurance at all on the car? No, it hasn't left, or it hasn't gone over yet. So when's the last time you've done any drugs? Uh, in years. Years? Yeah. OK. What, when you were using drugs, what was it you were using? Um, marijuana. Weed, OK. I got to verify the van on the vehicle. So okay. do you have any weapons on you real quick? No. I, uh, Without reaching? I'm not reaching. I'm looking to see if my knife was on my side. OK. Do you think you have a knife on you? Um, 
might be, yes. Okay, so why don't you set your Okay, why don't you set your wallet on the dash and just put the cigarette down on the ground. Go and stick your right hand behind your head, your left one out the window. Your left one out the window. I'm just trying to figure out why. Okay, you're good, man. Just go with this. What I'm asking you, step out. Just keep that hand. My phone. Go ahead and go ahead and reach down and put that phone. Yeah, I'm trying to figure okay. out why I'm getting ouch. All right, you're good, man. Okay. I got my um, title in the, actually in the house right there. Next All right, let's come back here and sit on the front of my car, okay? Okay. Just have a seat right there. Cross your feet for me, please. Okay. So again, registration. You made up a registration, it looks like. Or you put it on the date on the bill of sale, is that what you're saying? Yeah. Okay, so I don't know if this car is oh, okay. legitimate or not. Mom, can you grab my title? Okay, so, so you've had it how just, long? I just bought the car yesterday. Yesterday? Yeah. Okay. So I'm like, I'm I'm still trying to go through it. I know that the people that I bought it from, they um, have had pet problems in the past, drug offenses and stuff like that. Okay. Like when you're saying drugs, are you saying like meth or I, what are you? I didn't get you it. You don't know. Them. You don't know. I just, but you have your suspicions oh, of yeah. the people that you bought it from. So I respect that. You know about these? That'll hurt us. Well, that's what I was saying. I'm. I was explaining to him. I mean, I'm trying to clean the car. I just bought it yesterday. That was loaded. What? Yeah, it's got blood on it. Anyway. All right, go and turn around for me, guy. Smell the weed. Smell the weed? Just relax. Just relax, okay. guy. Just relax, OK? But what? Here, Mom. Turn, face this car. Jesus. Dad. What? Just relax, guy. We'll talk about it, OK? I had just bought the vehicle and everything. Ooh. Um, a little meth? I honestly don't know, but OK. Um, this yeah. is ridiculous. OK, just relax. I already did time. Why am I? All right. Why am I doing it? And once you come back here. Like this again, man. 2857. Have a seat right here on this curb. When you did meth, how were you doing meth? I was smoking it and snorting it. It's not, you don't shoot it? No. Never have? No. I... OK. Well, obviously, a loaded syringe is a concern of mine. Are you diabetic? No, I'm not. OK. What would you estimate that weight at? I think we're at about uh, maybe three grams. Three, yeah. Brad, let's be straight with one another, man. What is it? Uh, it looks like meth to me. OK. How much uh, did you pay for that little bag? Um, I didn't pay for the bag. But How'd you get it? I, I honestly. I can't tell you. How, I mean, I don't know. So people just give it to you? I don't. Brad. I'm, Brad. I'm being straight with you. Obviously, you understand that's a felony offense, right? Yes. OK. So you're going to go to jail on the possession of controlled substance, methamphetamine tonight, for also paraphernalia. Maybe you need a little help, man. So I'll be uh, flat out honest with you. He had a bunch of meth in his pocket, a over two grams of rock. OK, and he had a loaded syringe uh, up under the seat. It's obviously evidence in his pocket, wrapped up in his lot of money. Um, so he's going to have to go with us tonight. Yeah. I got an alert right here, and I uh, found a uh, capped loaded syringe right here, which would make sense. There's odor coming from there. Look up here. What the hell? What the hell in your pocket, honey? What is going on? I don't, I don't know. Brad, look at me. Look up here at me. There was a I use some, I know, it's not. And the stuff was in your pocket. What the hell? Talk to me. I know. You know better than that. You know yeah, I don't I know. like drugs and alcohol in there. I know. So what was it doing in your pocket? I'll call your job. Give me a. Uh, yeah, you're going. Mm -hmm. Hey. Uh, thank you, ma'am. Yep, thank you. Just let me know when I can pull that car over. Absolutely. When we get in the car, it's better to sit sideways. Been through this a few times. It's all right, guy. It's not, like I said, it's not the end of the world. And we'll, we're going to work with you, help you out a little bit here, and hopefully we can get you some help. Before I became a police officer, I was in the military for four years. I was in the uh, United States Navy. 
And as soon as I got home, I took the test and I got right on. And uh, I absolutely love being a police officer. I would probably do this for free if I, uh, if I had no other choice. We're going to be checking an address over in East Lynn. There was an anonymous caller that just uh, told us that there's a warrant suspect in the backyard. He's known to run from us. Uh, he's eluded capture before, so we're going to see if we can uh, take him into custody here. We're pulling down the street right now. Here, two to sixteen. Seventeen in control. Go ahead, seventeen. Roger. Thank you. Get on the ground. No. No. Get on the ground now! 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 Get on the ground! Help me! Help me! Please! Get, get on the ground! Ah! All right, get sprayed. I, I give get up, I give up, I give up. Get, get right? sprayed now. Get on the... Get I on your stomach now. Up. Get on your stomach. I'm rolling over. Get, get sprayed. I'm rolling over. Get on your stomach now. Put your hands behind your back. You're going to get it again. Get behind my back. Comfy. Fighting us back here. <laughs> hands behind your back. I can't see. Put your other hand behind your back. You're going to get sprayed again. I can't see, Ma. They pepper sprayed me. Just relax. Relax. Ah. Relax. Nah, yo, we we me. Yeah, just relax. Put your hands behind your back. You're still struggling. Relax. I'm all right. behind my. I'm good. My hands are behind my back. All right. My hands are behind my back. I'm not moving. Stand up. Guy, get the top of my face. You all right? Ah, I can't see. I can't see. What are you thinking? We'll get you some water. Ah. You all right? Get you some water, okay? I can't see. Can you breathe? I can't. I can't see. We'll get you some water. Just keep your eyes open, man. I know it hurts. I can't. I can't. We'll get you out front, all right? I can't. Help me, please. We got you, Janet. Oh, my God. I can't breathe. I can't see. You some pepper spray, I can't see. Never been pepper spray before? Nah. Oh. Okay. Come on, let's cut back. No, man, do that to my hey, 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 hey. Not, I love you. you. I love you. Wait for me, please. I'll give you a call on the station, all right? I'm touching my brother. Ah. Hey, I know don't you love your brother. Don't touch me. 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 Don't we're gonna get you water in the station, yeah. okay? You can I get some right now? I really can't Hold see. Hold on, I got some water. Hold on. Yeah, I got some water. Here. I really can't see. We're gonna roll the window down for you, Daniel. All right. Open your eyes up. Is that better? Hold on. Yes. Could you get my hair out of my face? Yeah. All right, we just gotta go to the station more. real quick. Keep your eyes open. Keep them open, because they got a liquid inside that washes it out, OK? It's the sign for that. Just keep them open. We're going to go to the station right we'll now. We'll let you wash it when we get to the station, all right? Well, Daniel, why'd you run? Because I don't want to get arrested. Why? I know, but you had these warrants for a while. Water, please? I know, once we get to the station. I know, but why'd you try to run it? Why don't you just turn yourself in? Can I just get some more water? My face is on fire. I cannot as soon as we get to the station, OK? Daniel, how come you didn't just turn yourself in a while ago? I don't want to get arrested. I know, but you got to face it, man. It's got... Can I just get some more water before you start driving, please? That's all I'm asking. Let me see if oh, I can uh, talk to the officer, street. give you some more water, OK? My eyes are on fire. Yeah. I know you don't want to go to jail, man, but you don't want this following you for the rest of your water? life. I can't keep my fight. I'm going to pass out. I know. Yeah, just breathe, all right? Out. Just take deep breaths, OK? I've been sprayed before. Daniel. I'm going to pass out. You're not going to pass out. You're going to be all right. Daniel. You didn't get that much. You know what you're being charged with, Daniel, right? What? Disorderly conduct, resisting arrest, and you have those two warrants, OK? All right. All right? Yeah. We're going to get you to the station and uh, get your eyes flushed out some more. Yeah. Once we get to the station, all right? What's that? Can we start driving? In a sec, OK? We just got to talk to your family. 
Just to let them know I what's can't going breathe. on. I know. Can I get some water? If we're just gonna sit here, can I get some water? We're not gonna sit here, okay? Ma! Anything else? I or? love you, Ma! Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Where's your phone? Ma'am. Who is that? I thought you said ma'am. Sorry. You know we had the warrants, ma'am. Oh, I know, I know. I know. This guy, I, know. I thought he said ma. So no, no, okay. Don't be ignorant to me. Back off me. No one's being ignorant. I'm not a criminal. I've never been a criminal, you know so back off. Nobody said you were, ma'am, okay? No, no. These are my children. We know that, ma'am. We're not trying to do that, okay? Not protect my children. I know, I know you are. A few weeks ago, he was able to get away from a few officers in a foot pursuit. Several times he's gotten away. Right, so yeah, got so by not tonight. Yeah. yeah. He's going to be looking at a number of charges. Disorderly conduct, a resisting arrest. I know he's got a bunch of warrants. I think one of them is for robbery. So definitely uh, good to get him off the streets. Doing this job seems like kind of a cat and mouse game, you know? They're doing whatever they can do to get away while we're doing whatever we can do to catch them. You might go from just simply talking and they, they're complying to be in one of the biggest fights you've, you've been in in your career. This car traveled over the center lane divide a few times. Gonna stop him, make sure he's not drunk. Finals on Pine Street by Frank. The reason I'm stopping you, you drove over the center line a few times back on Old Buncombe Road. Oh, okay, it was a car swerving. Oh, okay. Do you have your driver's license with you? Yes, sir. Just your car? It's my wrong car. I was in the car wreck. Huh? Why are you reaching all around? Oh, I'm getting my other phone. I'm Nothing phone. illegal in the car? No, sir. Any weapons? No, You're making me nervous reaching around. I'm man. sorry. I'm more than happy to help. All right, step out for me. And if you got a little weed and you tell me about it, I can give you a ticket. Jada, you out with Mason right if now? I just, if I have to find it, it's going to go different. Face that way. What was that you just picked up? Don't. Don't do it. No, chill out. I'm getting a you lighter. Chill out. It's my lighter. It's a lighter, look. It's a lighter. It's a lighter, I swear to God, look. Oh, it's a lighter, look. It's a lighter. Oh, Why are you doing this, motherfucker? Oh, Why are it's a lighter. It's a lighter. Just put it back behind your back. Yes, I was on the seat. I put the lighter in the car. I saw it. It was a lighter. Man, I swear to God, it was a lighter. What are you doing? Man, you got anything else on you? No. Roll over on your side. We're going to patch you down for weapons. I don't know. Man, man, I just got work. Man, I'm a working man. Y'all really don't understand. I got a problem. A switch on me. A cigar. That's it. I never do nothing. Are you serious? He wants us to come out there. Oh, y'all serious, man? What did I do? Yeah, it's crack cocaine. That's what you did. crack cocaine in my car. That's a runner. It's actually going to be heroin. Oh, my God, man. I saw it in his hand. That's why I'm pushing him up against the car. And he reached his hand in here and just kind of flipped it right here. It's heroin, right? No, sir. Are you serious? Just do, do what you told, man. All right, it's over. You're under arrest. We can found what you threw. Out, can I get my stuff out of my car, Come please? Come on. I need to get my phone, for real. We're going to get all your property. Come on. You should have just complied. I swear to God, man, I did not. You can swear to whoever you want to, dude. I watched on, you throw on. the bag. You, you, you did not watch me throw no bag, okay. I promise you. All right, tell me what I saw. Why don't you do that? Tell me what I saw. When I grabbed man. the lighter, when I grabbed the lighter. Look, are you a user? No. I swear to God. So you selling it? No, I'm not. I picked it up and I was going. I'm gonna tell you guys it's true. I picked it up and I was about to take it over to my homeboy. Cause he don't, he know what to do with it. Okay. Can you get my money and stuff too? We're gonna get all that. You been read your rights before, man? No, no y'all haven't said nothing to me. No, I mean before in your life. No. Sit down. Sit down. Have you ever Sit been down, a long time ago. Sit down, dude. I'm gonna try to find my wife. What's your name again? Leandre. Leandre, you have the right to remain silent. Anything no, you no, say no, can no, and will be used against you in court no, law. Not till y'all tell me why. Y'all got to. And yep. can you loosen these handcuffs, please? Okay, please. Sit down, dude. Please, please. Sit please, down. Lo loosen the handcuffs. Sit down, I'm gonna sit you down. You already slammed me on the ground for no reason. You have the right to talk to an attorney and have him or her present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire an attorney, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning, if you wish. Do you understand that? That's all I'm asking. I'm not answering nothing. Do you understand? I'm not answering nothing until I talk to me a lawyer. 
You have anything hidden in your butt, dude? Got a blunt for me to smoke. You worried about some weed? Is there anything man. else in your butt in yes, your pants? Man. Okay, come on. Okay. Face that way, dude. Okay, I'll, face I, that can way. I get it out, please? I'll... Face around. No, I know. Okay, thank you. But Girl. I swear to God, that that other stuff was not mine. I promise you. Set it on the back. Thank you. What else is back there? That's it, man. Because right. you're going to jail. If you take anything in the jail. Y'all won't talk to you. Yeah. You're going to have time. Hey, sir, just to let you know, I'll check my back seat. So we, we didn't stuff anything under the seat. But did I it? promise. Look, like you did it or no? No, I knew. Okay, thank you. But Girl. I swear to God. Be banging or something? Oh, don't sleep about me. Okay, 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 I'm good. I'm good. I promise. No, man. You're I, I'm confident. And if you do anything else, I, I promise, I'm we're gonna confident. tie your feet together. Okay, I'm, okay, I'm good. I'm, no seatbelt. No then just act like okay, an please, adult, no dude. I will. I will. I swear to God, no seatbelt, please. I promise you, I got you. No seatbelt. But I, I really can't lose my job. Look, man, we're gonna seatbelt you. You're gonna see oh, a judge at 2:30. Okay, sir. No, I can't see no. Oh my God, please, no. <laughs> All right, I'm just testing this uh, substance I believe to be heroin with this uh, test kit. Basically, uh, you break break these ampules. Uh, if it turns to that green color, it'll be a positive. Which you can already see. It's turning green right here in the bottom. So that'll be a positive for heroin. So we got possession of heroin, possession of marijuana, yep. interfering. Yep. You good, bud? Yes, sir. All right. We did test it. It was heroin, not hash. So. Oh my God. Oh, no. You thought it was hash? <laughs> oh, no. But look, that look. Nothing to play with. No. Yeah, but you still get out tonight on bond, man. All right. It is what it is. We're gonna be cool with you. Just be cool with us. All right. Uh, I've been with Boise. PD now for about four and a half years, a total of 19. I know that that's kind of a common thing that when you ask a police officer what he wanted to do, that he always wanted to be a police officer. But for me, that was the truth. Went with my dreams and worked out for me. Yeah, we're stopping this car right now. It's uh, got a front signal that's apparently the bulb is out on it. The rear one works, but the front one's not. So we'll stop him, have a talk with him about it. 2317, Trevor. How are we doing tonight? Can you hear me? How you doing, man? Can you uh, hand me your driver's license registration insurance? The reason I stopped you, bud, your front signal is not working to the left. I know. OK. You know that's not working? Yeah. So what's going on with it? It needs a bulb. Well, can you turn your car off? Are you living right here now? I'm dropping me off. I'm dropping him off. Dropping you off? Mm -hmm. OK. What's your name? Charlie. Yeah. Hold on a second, Charlie. You don't have ID on you? Nope. What are you doing out with these guys tonight? Oh, I just got to back from my friend's house playing video games to kill him. You had to go to your friends to play video games? And how old are you? 15. You, you had anything to drink tonight? No. Nothing at all? No. Anybody been drinking? So I was just like hanging out with friends, because. All right, stay right where you're at. I'm going to come over and talk to him. You just kind of sound like you've got slurred speech. Is that how you always talk? No. Yes. No? Because you're nervous or what? Yeah. Don't be nervous. I'm just right. talking to you. OK? OK. OK, have you have you taken anything tonight or any alcohol? Nothing at all? Everything's cool there? Let me take a look at your eyes, OK? Just keep your head still. Follow my finger, just with your eyes. All the way out. Be honest with me, man. Be honest with me. If you're not being honest with me, then it's going to go south. Come on out. Drink a little bit. All right, now we're getting somewhere. Come on out. You guys been drinking too? No, sir, I haven't. Have a seat right here for me on the, on the curb. Already? No, down here a little bit for me. OK, anything in your pockets? Yes. What do you got? I stole some beer. Sit down. Oh. What do you got? Three beers on my pockets. OK, don't move. Just stay right there. Just stay right there. Oh. 
2317. Stay right, don't touch them, just stay. Give me a code two. Just leave them, just leave them. Okay, sit back up for now. I don't want, I don't want them broken. You're not listening to me. Have a seat, man. Where'd you steal these from? The store? Nope. Where'd you get them? A friend's house. Does he know you stole them? Nope. Were they given to you or did you take them? Took them. That's the only thing you took? Yeah. What else you got in your pockets? That's it, sir. And they don't even know I took this, so. What, these guys don't know you took them? Uh-uh. Is there anything else in the car? Nothing I know of, no. Your mom home? Pretty sure, yeah. What's mama gonna say? She's gonna be flipping pissed. She's not gonna be happy, is she? First time drinking in my entire life. This is what happens. Better days. I'm Officer Anderson. Hi. Hey, your son's been honest with me up to this point, OK? I didn't have any major problems with him. But the problem is that he was in possession of these beers right here. He had them stuffed in his pants. And he's been drinking tonight. So I'm going to I'm gonna do him a favor and, and release him back to you, but he's going to get a ticket. OK. OK? So his biggest concern is that he was going to go to jail. I think that's probably something that mom can handle. Right. With a citation and, and hearing from mom, I'm sure this will get resolved, right? Oh, yeah, he's in trouble. OK. Yeah? What are you doing? Being stupid. Yeah, you're in so much trouble. Why are you drinking? Trying to have fun. Have a seat right here. Mom can talk to you a little bit longer. I need to finish the citation. Mm -hmm. Have a seat. I'm, it sounds like she wants to have a private conversation with you. That's dumb. I didn't think we'd get pulled over. What? You're 15. I know, but I was still just trying to get. You don't know, because look where we're at right now. You don't know. You're not supposed to have alcohol with you, period. You're not 21 years old. This dude's 15. You're how old? 26. Okay, you're, I mean, did he get the alcohol from you? No, sir. Just he give didn't. me a straight story. He didn't. Okay. No. Did you know he had it? No, I didn't. Is there anything else in the car that I'd be concerned about? No. Any weed? No. Nothing? Nothing. Here's what's going to happen. You're going to get a citation, like I told you, for minor consumption of alcohol. Okay. And possessing it is the same charge. You're headed down a path that's not going to be good for you if you're still in beer at 15 and out at this hour drinking. These guys are 10 years older than you. You're hanging out with guys that are, are allowed to do that because they're that age, but right. for you, no. OK? Well, I just thought that it was time to have some fun. No. Well, you got you got to wait your turn. Right. Your, your time to have fun for this is 21. If you're young, you're going to screw all your intestines up before you're even old enough to know what to do with your life. All right. OK. So I'm going to give your mom the citation because she's responsible for getting you down to court. OK. She's already been explained to what's going on here. I have to miss work because of you. Sorry. You owe your mom an apology, I would say, right? Yeah. OK. I'm going to take these handcuffs. I'm going to do all my dishes right now. I'm going to take these handcuffs off you. This is the end of it, right? Hopefully, yeah. Hopefully? Hopefully. That's probably not the answer you want to give. Would have been nice if they would, guys would have locked him up for a day. Well, in the future, that could happen to you. That would have sucked. You don't want that to happen to you, right? Do it again. Right. This is the end of it, right? Yeah. OK. Yes, you owe your mom an apology. Sorry, Mom. You dumbass. You're Sorry for what? You're drinking under the age of 21. And for shoving beer in your pants? At two. All right, have a good night. If you're waiting on him, he's in some trouble. All right. Uh, sure. uh, <laughs> His night's over. Yeah, okay. I guess so, huh? Uh, Mom's got him now, guys. <laughs> 132 in Bush, I've got him at gunpoint. OK, gunpoint, 132 in Bush, coverage code 3. Thanks, Ted. Good, 2514, can't transmit on tech 2. 1047, 1047, can't transmit on 4360. OK, we'll still send a code 3. 